money, 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 money. We're in the money. We're in the money. We're in the money. With my mind on my money and my money on my mind. You see, I'm singing all these songs that got money in it. Uh, let me see. Money, cash, what? Money, cash. Money, cash, what? Money. <laughs> What about this one? Ain't nothing going on but the rent. You got to have a J-O-B if you want to be with me. No romance without finance. What's up, y'all? This is Ty. Don't you see the common thread here? It's all about money. Money, 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 money. So, uh, last week, I was uh, going through some things and deciding whether or not I was going to buy a house or a condo so you know you need money for those things i also went to a financial seminar i saw a financial advisor they were they taught us a lot of things we spoke about you know putting money away buying a house stocks bonds also um i subscribed to money magazine and i got my first uh magazine in the mail the other day and as I was reading this, this is a true story, this is crazy. As I was reading this, my phone rings and I got invited by a friend to see this movie called The Big Short. And what is The Big Short about? The Big Short is about the housing crisis and money. So I just said, you know, that's funny that, that how that played out like that. So when I was asked to go see this screening of The Big Short, I said, hmm. What is that about? So I Googled it because I hadn't heard of that. And what I learned was The Big Short is based on a book by Michael Lewis. It's called The Big Short Inside the Doomsday Machine. I will be picking that book up. Um, and it's basically discussing uh, several key players. Listen to this. Several key, key players in the creation of the credit default swap market that sought to bet against the collateralized debt obligation bubble and thus ended up profiting from the financial crisis of 2007 and 2010. Now, that sounds like a serious drama, right? That doesn't sound like it was going to be... It just, to me, I was like, oh, okay, so let's see what this is about. Well, I got in the theater. When I tell you this movie was engaging, entertaining, well-acted, and it was hilarious hilarious and I just was amazed at how they could take such a serious topic and and have humor and find humor in it in such a very tragic because people lost their homes people lost money but it was you know in this crisis I know if you remember that a lot of companies went belly up Bear Stearns Lehman Brothers a place that I used to temp at and I, that was sad to see them go it was was a fun company when I temp there but um those that's a serious thing that housing bubble thing was serious but the way the director adam mckay who directed anchorman the way he directed this film was great it was fast paced it had a, a lot of humor um it was very informative there were some things that i did not know that i learned and the cast was phenomenal you had ryan gosling you had brad pitt Steve Carell and Christian Bell. Steve Carell and Christian Bell were my favorites in this movie, and Ryan Gosling too, but Steve Carell, I just loved the character who was loosely based on um, someone from the book. I loved his character who had this uh, anger inside of him because of something tragic that happened in his life. I'm not going to spoil it for you, so he just... He wouldn't deal with that, but he was just ferocious and, you know, trying to, you know, expose this this soon to be bubble bursting you know it was just really great his i loved how he played that role he was funny he was tragic all in one he you know i i really enjoyed it and i'm glad to know that he's got a um golden globe nomination the film has a few golden globe nominations this was a great ensemble the cast is entertaining the movie moves at a, a great pace um what I also liked was how they broke the fifth, the fourth wall. So the characters would 
stop and speak directly to the audience and say, well, that's not how that happened. Actually, it happened like this. So I thought that was kind of kind of clever because, you know, when they do these based on a true story films, Hollywood always gives a Hollywood spin on certain scenes. So I liked how the characters were able to come out and say, well, it didn't happen like that. It actually happened like this, but carry on. And then they would explain certain things and put some financial uh, jargon into layman's terms for us folks that don't understand all of that. So I really enjoyed this film. I thought it was engaging. I thought it was funny. It was fast paced. Um, if you want something to go see, I say check it out. It was a big surprise for me. I really enjoyed it. It's called The Big Short. Who did I say starred in it? It's Ryan Gosling. It's Brad Pitt. Steve Carell, Christian Bell, um, Marissa Tomei is in there. There's a few others. I can't remember their names, but it was a great film directed by Adam McKay. What else can I say? Go check this film out. And um, check the book out, too, because I'm going to check the book out, too, because I really want to know. But I know this film made me say, damn, I got to save some more money. I got to be on the up and up. I got to get my credit together. I get, I don't know. Money's been on the mind. You see this bank? This bank needs to be filled up. <laughs> so with that said, go check it out. Also, check out my other videos. You're going to love them. Like, comment, subscribe. Um... Speaking of money, before I get out of here, I have a GoFundMe page because I'm trying to work on an album and I need some money. Yes, see that. Ah, do you see how I put that in there? Money. I need some money. So I'm going to put the link down below. I think it's GoFundMe slash Ty Harrell. Please go fund me. Give me some money. I need it. Thank you. Anyway, thank you for watching. Be blessed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. If you don't like it, that's cool too. But thank you for watching. Check out The Big Short. Try to get the book. I'm going to go get the book too because I think I'm going to enjoy the book because I really enjoyed the movie. See, I told you this was going to be quick. All right, that's it. Be blessed. Peace.